What keeps you going with, you know, the New York Marathon, London, Chicago, the ones that you know so well? What keeps you wanting to win these races? I love wheelchair racing and I want to push not only myself but the sport and I have done something unbelievable that yeah. no wheelchair racer or an able body runner has ever done was to win four major marathons and this in seven consecutive marathon wins it is absolutely unbelievable and sometimes I still pinch myself <laughs> of everything that I've done um, but I just love pushing my body and I love inspiring others and sharing my story and see how far I can push not only myself but my sport and others to get involved. I remember once talking with you maybe at last year where you said you feel like you've already been through so much the pain of training the the pain of race day all of the sacrifices just seems like nothing to you because of what you've been through. Yes, I've been through so much in my life, um, just all the emotions of being adopted, seeing my birth family, to losing races, to winning races for training and preparation and the hard work, but it's just, my life has ended up somewhere, it's just, it's a miracle with everything that has happened and with all the accomplishments, I never regret anything and all the hard work and the time the commitment has paid off. Yeah. We were looking on your Instagram feed because you ha are one of the best follows because we're never mm -hmm. sure who you're going to be meeting or what you're going to be doing. <laughs> we had to ask you a few questions, though, because there were a couple, especially. Let's go to our first Instagram photo of, of Tatiana McFadden. Are you flying a plane? Are you? <laughs> oh, yes. I am. Did you really yep. fly that plane? What's going on there? I wish. I asked the pilot, I was like, okay, well, if we exchange, can I fly us home and you can hold my Sochi medal? Um, so that, yeah, that was such a great experience. That was on my way home. Um, so I was trying to bargain with him. I'm a, I'm telling him I'm a good driver in my <laughs> chair, and but he didn't buy it. And uh, but it was such a great experience. Maybe um, that's next for you, pay pilots maybe, license or something. Maybe we have a few more Instagram pictures. One was you with Michael Sam. Oh my gosh, that his story. I cried during that SBS. Uh, just his story is absolutely unbelievable and he is just so strong and so powerful and his story is absolutely unbelievable and uh, so many people can relate to him and I he is so empowering and I yeah just meeting him I was like shaking and in awe and wanting to cry at the same time and it's it's unbelievable where the people that you get to meet through athletics and getting to know people and hearing their stories, I think just brings us closer together, which is unbelievable. It's amazing to see what inspires you because you inspire so many people, someone like Michael Sam. And we have one more for you, and this is one of our favorite guests from SI Now, Richard Sherman. I oh, mean, I did he challenge talk <laughs> you in this photo? He looks like he's being nice there. I challenged him in a basketball um, shootout at the ESPYs. He is so nice yeah. and unbelievable. and. I, that's what I love about the ESPYs is everyone's just so casually there together and just chit-chatting and it's just so nice. Yeah.